Recently, our company's technology has received some publicity. But today, we received news that our competitor starting development on their technology, similar to our company's core technology. It must have been someone that stole confidential info. The question is, which one of us did it? Earlier this year, Ryan came from the rivalry company. His networking and marketing skills are so smooth that it would be great if he was on our side. But if we lose him, it would be tough for the company. Peter is a genius whose hard work for the past five years has contributed to our success. He's most knowledgeable with our data and downloads the most. He even prefers to be praised only when he is the sole recipient. It's probably not Emma. I don't want to say this, but she and I have a uh, history together. Can you just imagine when I do win the lottery? <laughs> I would never look back at this torturous place. Not even for a second. No one really knows what Harvey does. To be honest, no one really cares to know what his work involves. People call him AI Harvey, or an insignificant Harvey. Now some people just even call him AI. <laughs> what? No way. Okay, maybe once or twice. Will we end up in shambles after all our hard work? Will our investors ditch us and move to the competitor? Will our trust in each other be broken because of this? Yeah, Believe in humans. Black Box does the doubt. Now look at history. After he joined our company, he has listed and saved the competitor company's address and contact info. It even looks like he's periodically looking at job postings at various other companies. So Ryan is keeping close tabs with the rivalry company he came from. Her browsing history shows a lot of shopping websites. Wait, she's downloaded the requirements for applying to a fashion design graduate school. She must be leaving the company soon. There are lots of network access and company data downloads as expected. Interestingly, he downloads in Chinese, Russian, and Japanese. Peter is interested in a foreign language and is a tad unique in that regard. We've come a long way together. And I want to keep my trust in all of you. Let's pause now and start fresh while we can. Let's be open and honest today. I love my job, and I just want to say I love you guys. Peter doesn't browse translation websites anymore like he used to. He also took some time off from work. We have an invaluable workplace to defend with these people whom I cherish. I will build a bigger future, a brighter future for Unicorn.